Hey YouTube, um, this is a video I've been uh, wanting to make for a few weeks and I hope you guys find it useful. Um, essentially what I wanted to do here was take a bunch of documents, maybe bills um, if you're a student, you know, notes from different classes and be able to kind of um, scan them all at once um, using an auto, ski, auto um, feed scanner um, and have some sort of document some sort of program split them up um, and, and organize them. So uh, that's what I'm trying to accomplish in this video. Um, and uh, this is just kind of a you know, proof of concept and I will make a, a how-to video uh, soon. So um, to start off, uh, I just wanted to show you, these are um, custom made barcodes. And this is what we're gonna be using to differentiate between different documents. Um, so, so in here you see I have bills. So all you'd have to do is have to have uh, barcodes of each of the different document types you wanted. Um, so maybe you had a barcode for each of your classes. Maybe you had a barcode for, for bank statements right here. Maybe you had a barcode um, for bills. Um, you know, you can keep it pretty simple or you can make it as complicated as you want to. The bottom line is that you can take all these documents that you've acquired over the course of the day and basically by sorting them in what could would amount to probably 30 seconds, um, you just throw them in the auto scanner here and uh, then the program on my computer does the rest. So um, I just wanted to give you guys a brief explanation as to why I'm doing this, um, why I, I think it's an important thing and why I think it'd be it's useful to you guys and which is why I'm sharing it to you, with you. Um, I'm going to medical school next year and I recognize I'll be dealing with a ton of documents um, and I want to have all these available to me. Um, on Dropbox. And so the only way I'm going to do that is, I guess there's a few ways. You could take pictures with your camera, but that is, that's a pain. You know, the camera's not fast. It's not fast. It's not elegant. And you still have to pay, you know, save each of the documents. It, it would take forever. Even if you use the scanner in its current state where it just sits here and then it, I scan documents, then I have to go in and split the PDF into you know, multiple PDFs and uh, rename all of them and put them in the appropriate folders. And I just, I just have no patience for that. Um, and I don't think that's a sustainable practice, especially if I'm a visit, if I'm in medical school. I just don't think that's reasonable. So the only the thing the only way I think I'll actually adhere to something like this, where I have electronic documents of the notes that I've taken in class, or um, just documents that I need for school. I want for each day, for each course, the notes I take um, be a separate document that I could then send to classmates. Um, because I think that's ultimately far more useful because you're not only able to kind of have access to your stuff for yourself, but you're able to help your classmates by sending your notes to, you know, around. And I think, I think that's, that's kind of what I'm trying to accomplish here. And I think I have accomplished it. The programs we'll be using to uh, accomplish this are the APDF barcode split service and move out. Um, this program takes the PDFs, splits them into um, the individual documents based off um, the barcodes as we were talking about earlier and move it out uh, recognizes uh, specific names um, of files and moves them to the appropriate folder um, as you can see you set that up all right just to uh, clarify this is the folder where the file the PDFs will be sent from the printer to the computer um, they will be picked up and then split and then they will show up here and then once they're split move out um, which is the application will we'll recognize the name of the file and then move it to the appropriate file. So this is a bank, bills, um, chemistry, and biology, as you can see. So that this will show you the entire process after I press scan, what will happen. And you'll be able to see how each um, file moves from one step to the next. So without further ado, here's the entire process from start to finish. It's going to bring it over here. See all the documents biology, chemistry, bills, and bank. And there they are, each in their own folder. This is a really easy thing to set up. It takes 
it took me a few hours to figure out how to do it and what where to find the right programs to do it. But once you set this up, you might have to spend a few minutes making uh, barcode pages. But other than that, um, the amount of time is relatively um, relatively small. That wasn't it wasn't this like this didn't take multiple takes. This was uh, first first take. Um, you know, was a success. So um, I hope I hope you find this useful and exciting. Um, thank you very much for your time and uh, have a good day.